So this is our local surf break, KA. It's a, I'm not at the best angle to catch the swell. There you go. It's one surfer out. He's catching he's catching short sets. And it's also our local beach, sand beach that is. It's a really sweet, unpopulated spot. I love to paddle out here from my house, which is over there. Actually, up there. <laughs> See if I can point to it. <laughs> if you see that house on the hill, choo, 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 my house is just across the street right there. And okay, look at Kua Bay. Let's see, this, this is day number five after the tsunami. One fishing boat, one tourist boat, two tourist boats. And there's one boat over there by the poly working on cleanup. I did a bunch of hours every day and today I'm getting back to work and taking care of some things but also just wanted to come out for a paddle in the bay. Which I haven't done since the tsunami hit. It feels really nice. today, not too bad. What else do you need? One nice reef break, one sandy beach, a beautiful mountain embracing us. Awesome little neighborhood. Super sacred bay, marine life sanctuary. And a really sweet board. And just for you, Liz, see if I can lay it out there. Oh my gosh, I love my paddle. Quick. Blade Elite Racer. It is so sweet. <laughs> the handles so comfortable. The grip is so comfortable. The shaft is perfect. Texture for grip. And the blade is just feathers and pushes water so beautifully. It's amazing. The shapes on the end to cut. It's, it's amazing. And Mickey Munoz stock board. Good stuff. Thanks everybody for kidding me out for my training. And my pleasure and enjoyment. I promise everybody I am doing my paddle yoga boarding too, but a little racing in between doesn't hurt. A little training. <laughs> I'm not a good enough surfer to surf that reef break yet. But I can paddle in and out of this bay all day long. <laughs>